Hi everybody, today is February 16th, 2013. Roof collapse at Chernobyl nuclear power plant sparks fear of radiation leaks. Part of the roof has collapsed at Ukraine's Chernobyl nuclear plant where an explosion and a reactor meltdown occurred in 1986. But authorities claim the site remains sealed and that there's been no changes in the radiation level. You know darn well they're lying. There was talk that the sarcophagus that was built around it would need to be replaced because cracks were forming. This thing is still putting out very deadly high doses of radiation. Some 80 construction workers were present at the site at the time of the incident, but no injuries were reported. A massive concrete sarcophagus, which was built to contain leaking radiation from the exploded nuclear reactor, was not damaged by the roof collapse. There are no changes in the radiation situation at the Chernobyl nuclear power plant or in the exclusion zone, Chernobyl's administration said in a statement the BBC reported. The new concrete enclave is currently being built to place over the existing one amid concerns over a long-term structural integrity. The Chernobyl accident has gone down as the worst nuclear disaster in history and resulted in the displacement of hundreds of thousands of people in Ukraine. Belisarus and Western Russia with thousands thought to be exposed to high levels of radiation. The number of deaths related to the accident remain a matter of controversy. I had heard about 35,000 people had died and that's worldwide I believe. At the time the plant was under direct administration by now the defunct Soviet Union. The area surrounding the Chernobyl plant remains contaminated with radiation and an exclusion zone extends outward from the site over territory within a 19 mile radius. It's interesting how milk that's contaminated with radiation, what the farmers do is they uh, dilute it down with milk that's not contaminated and then sell it to market. And they have an image here from Reuters that says a view shows a partially damaged exterior construction of the engine room of unit number four of the Chernobyl nuclear power plant Wednesday. About 600 square meters of the wall and the roof on Tuesday collapsed under a heavy blanket of snow, though nobody was hurt due to the accident according to local media. And it's not a very good image, is it? All right, bookmark my site. I'll keep everyone up to date. Please stay safe, and I'll talk to you later. God bless you all. Bye.